Hello everyone, welcome back again to my channel, Yam Hem Educa Mix TV 25. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much. So now let's talk about human development, its meaning, concepts, and approaches. So human development is the pattern of movement or change that begins at conception and continues through the lifespan. Development includes growth and decline, according to Suntrack 2002. So here are some major principles of human development. First, development is relatively orderly. Next, while the pattern of development is likely to be similar, the outcomes of developmental processes and the rate of development are likely to vary among individuals. Development takes place gradually. Development as a process is complex because it is the product of biological, cognitive, and socio-emotional processes. It's still according to Sunshack 2002. There are two approaches to human development. First is traditional approach. It is a belief showing that there is an extensive change from birth to adolescence. Little or no change in adulthood and decline in late old age. Next is the lifespan approach. It is a belief showing that even in adulthood developmental change takes place as it does during childhood. So what are the characteristics of the lifespan perspective? First is, development is lifelong. It does not end in adulthood. No developmental stage dominates development. Another, development is multidimensional. It is consists of biological, cognitive, and socio-emotional dimensions. Development is plastic. Development is possible throughout the lifespan. Next is development is contextual. Individuals are changing beings in a changing world. Next is development involves growth, maintenance, and regulation. The goals of individuals vary among developmental stages. For instance, as individuals reach middle and adulthood, concern with growth gets into the backstage, while maintenance and regulation take the center stage. So here are the developmental stages or tasks. Prenatal period from conception to birth. It involves tremendous growth from single cell to an organism complete with brain and behavioral capabilities. Next is the infancy period from birth to 18 to 24 months. It is a time of extreme dependence on adults. Many psychological activities are just beginning like language, symbolic thought, sensory motor coordination, and social learning. Early childhood, end of infancy to 5 to 6 years. These are the preschool years. Young children develop school readiness skills and spend many hours in play with peers. Next is middle and late childhood, 6 to 11 years of age, the elementary school years. The fundamental skills of reading, writing, and arithmetic are mastered. The child is formally exposed to the larger world in its culture. Achievement becomes a more central theme of the child's world and self-control increases. Next is the adolescent stage, 10 to 12 years of age ending up to 18 to 22 years of age. Begins with rapid physical changes, dramatic gains in height and weight, changes in body contour, and the development of sexual characteristics such as enlargement of the breast, development of pubic and facial hair, and deepening of the voice. Pursuit of independence and identity are prominent. Thought is more logical, abstract, and idealistic. More time is spent outside of the family. Next is early adulthood stage, from late teens or early 20s, last through the 30s. It is a time of establishing personal and economic independence, career development, selecting a mate, learning to live with someone in an intimate way, starting a family, and rearing children. 
Middle adulthood stage, 40 to 60 years of age. It is a time of expanding personal and social involvement and responsibility, of assisting the next generation in becoming competent in mature individuals, and of reaching and maintaining satisfaction in a career. Late adulthood stage, 60s and above. It is a time for adjustment to decreasing strength and health, life review, retirement, and adjustment to new social rules. So these are the developmental stages or tasks. Thank you for watching.